this is my phone that I'm calling because it's there. At least it rings, so it means it's charged. Yeah. <clears throat> charged and not. I'm, I'm wondering if she's gonna pick it up. Um, you have a pen? Yeah, paper? I do. Just yes. like any little slip or I something do, I can write a couple notes on. And it can be the back of like something. Um, and then we're gonna try and call her. So, uh, the judge uh, told me not to go to the house 200 yards within the house, but when I was getting released, perfect, thank you, I was asking the guard, he said, in the paperwork, it doesn't say anything about calling her. So they advised me to be careful on how I talk to her, not to piss her off. Well, you can, you can <laughs> do that, right? Actually, man, what they said that. word for word. Like, yeah, you can do I'm that. Paraf no, I'm paraphrasing a little bit, but that's that's what they told me. Gotcha. Um, but, uh, okay, so here is uh, her... Uh, um, I'm pretty surprised that I even remember this number, to be honest. Did you remember my number? And then, no, I had okay. to call her and she gave That'd it to me creepy, from right? my phone. I mean, kind of weird. Well, I mean, I wish. It's like you uh, had a crush on me. I just wish I did. My number. It would have made things easier. I understand. Hi, Hi uh, I'm at Speedy's. I don't know if you're maybe watching his stream. She doesn't watch Speedy. You know, you could do that, and you could see what I'm doing, but. Uh, um, Speedy's gonna go grab some of my things. Okay. Hello? Well, yeah, he's not gonna stay. He's just gonna grab a couple of my things and uh, come and just bring them to me. Uh, how are you doing? I want him to come over. Well, okay, but how are you doing? Huh? Are you gonna still try and be with me? Yeah, I'm gonna try and be with you, but uh, you know the judgment is 200 yards from the apartment. Hmm? The, the what? My release condition is that I can't go within 200 yards of the apartment we live in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I'm, I'm staying with Speedy right now. I'm gonna need a couple things, just my laptop, my phone, and the wallet, couple of clothes. Just wait. Well, but wait for what? I mean, if you don't give me like a pair of shoes and like a couple of socks and stuff, I, then I need to go buy some at uh, Goodwill. And I need my wallet and my phone. So would you prefer someone else come over and get them? Well, I mean, I know stop speeding oh so well. So, so who, who else could, like, uh, do you want like... Restraining orders on that. Well, Joe is here, yes, I, I, it's pretty much a restraining yeah. order. Uh, yeah, I, I've, I've had one on him my entire life. <laughs> Isn't that neat, babe? <laughs> but I love you. Have fun with that. Trench tip $3.33. Shout out to Guava, she is so pretty. Well, I think if Speedy doesn't go, then the bondsman is eventually going to go and... I just need, I need to be able to be a person. That's right. And I need to... The what? I can, I can light this, right? You don't care. Did she hang up? Okay, we'll give it a minute. I mean, we talked to her on stream, whatever. That's good. What is her deal with thinking, like, I raped her or something? What is that? 
Well, she said know, well. a bunch of times that I've raped her. Okay, well, you know that's not true. Um, <laughs> I mean, the only time anything's ever happened, you were in the room, so, I mean, just saying. Uh, she had said some things about dope, so, uh, I mean, it's, uh, well, that's, that's the hard part, but, you know, the authorities kind of realize what's going on. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And, I mean, uh, we'll see, we'll see, we'll just have to let it play out. You can use this phone while you're here, though, man. Yeah, thank you, awesome. It's, uh, 420. Well, okay. Yeah. Okay. And then, yeah. Well, it's kind of useless to me. I, other than, I like, understand. this, what I just did. Uh, I could, like, browse a little bit, I guess. Yeah, you can browse. Browse man. IP2. Browse IP2. Uh, I'm going to take a few shots, and... I, I can just smoke, smoke this outside. I don't, I don't yeah, really, I really don't want to smoke this outside. You're fine, dude. Either way, either way. Either way. Either or, um, I'm about to chug this guy's, and I'm gonna go do IRL, and I think Attila will come with me. Yeah, Attila will come with me. Um, we've made some pretty decent donuts this morning, so yeah, we got enough for an Uber. We can go downtown it's Saturday, so hopefully some cool shit's going on today. Uh, I'm fucking hoping. And yeah, because it'd be cool to go take Attila out, get drunk at a bar maybe, and get him some like new pussy, so he gets his mind off Attila. Maybe if he finds some better pussy, he'll fall in love with that, and he won't mess with her anymore. That's usually uh, how that works, in my experience, anyways. That's usually how that is. So, dress Attila a squirtle. <laughs> that would be fucking hilarious, dude. <laughs> Arrested? Ah, oh, dude, I hope not, man. But you never know with fucking IRL these days. You're taking a risk every time you go IRL. Because, yeah, you don't know what they're going to fucking hit you up with nowadays, man. They're after all the IRL streamers. I'm like one of the last ones standing. So they're definitely gunning for me, man. They're gunning hard for me. Axe IRL, dude. If I can go over there and get a shit, I'm definitely grabbing the axe. You fucking goddamn right I'm grabbing that axe. I'm gonna fucking put that axe in the IRL Hall of Fame right next to my very first Jinkum Cup. Yeah, it's going right up there with Blade's Toe. That fucking axe, man. It's the most famous axe in the world. Right next to fucking, uh, you know, that fucking kid story about the lumberjack, his axe. Like, his axe is, like, it's up there with, like, most famous axes of all time. The axe that Jason used in Friday the 13th, Attila's is even more famous than that axe. He's got a very famous axe. The axe in Psycho has nothing on Attila's axe. 